Jordan fires to Aguayo on the first. Dug out of there by Hardy. I'm Aggie infield coach JT Bloodworth, and welcome to Aggie Academy. Handled by Hardy, throws to Aguayo. They get the double play. In today's lesson, I'm going to show you defensive infield drills. The short hop drill contains three parts, right at you, to your forehand, and to your backhand. Right at you, we have a good wide base, giving us a good short hop, bringing it into our chest, soft hands. On the forehand side, we open up, we make sure we have a good wide base still, we're athletic in our legs. Again, we're getting a good feed from our partner. We're staying behind the ball, working below the ball. On the backhand side, same thing, we open up, this is called the routine backhand. We're working below the ball. Again, in a good athletic position like you see here, with the partner giving a good feed. This is the short fungo drill. I'm set up 20 feet from the player. The player will be on his knees, which isolates his legs. I will hit the ball to his right and to his left so he can work his hands side to side. It forces him to rely on his glove and to have soft hands in order to catch the ball cleanly. This is the reaction drill. Your player will be on the infield and the coach will have a fungo in his hand. The player's back will be turned to you and once you hit the ball, when the ball is halfway there, you will say, now, the player will proceed to turn around, react to the ball as quickly as possible, field it, and make a throw to first base. This is the wall drill. Requires three people, 10 balls on each side. It's basically rapid fire. As you can see, Ryan's working his hands really good, has a good wide base. Once he gets the ball, he discards it to the side, and the other one's coming. This is developing hands, quick hands, and soft hands. I'm JT Bloodworth, and this has been Aggie Academy.